And this is the location where all that police, police activity was on Friday. Mass State Police, Boston Police. Take it into this alleyway. Right on that grass is where that suspect was arrested after he jumped from that roof and broke his foot before he was placed under arrest. But today in a Boston courtroom, police showed up to show their support. That's the voice of the Boston police officer who was attempting to stop the robbery of a pizza delivery person Friday night when the suspect started shooting at the officer, hitting the seven-year veteran in the back and leg. Court, all right. In court this morning, more than 80 Boston police officers came to see the arraignment of 23-year-old John Lazar of Brockton. He arrived in a wheelchair after breaking his foot, jumping off this roof while trying to run from police on Friday night but was able to stay off camera as prosecutors read off a list of charges. Further inspection of the firearm that was found at the scene revealed one round in the chamber and 10 in the magazine, and a search of the gun's serial number showed that it was reported stolen in Vermont. The defendant does not have a license to carry. Boston police say they showed up in force in the courtroom to send a message to the public and politicians that defunding the police will not help them in the street. You need police officers. You cannot have a lawless society, and that's what we have. And until we put more cops on the street, until we hire a more balanced police force, until we put more money in the budget, you're going to continue to see violence rise. You're going to continue to see people hurt. That suspect is being held without bail right now, and the good news, that Boston police officer was released from Boston Medical Center late last night.